An ecological organization has four levels. The lowest level includes individual organisms, then we have a population, then we have communities, and then finally we have the whole ecosystem. Individual species are living species, for example every plant and animal species on the planet which also includes bacteria and fungi. A population is a specific group of species living together in a particular area. For example, all the individual Colorado potato beetles in a potato field comprise a population. In a community, each species depend on other species for food, shelter and pollination. If one species gets removed, it can affect the whole population. A stable community is where all species and environmental factors are in balance, so the population size remains fairly constant. Lastly, we have the ecosystem, which is a biological environment including living and non-living things in a specific region. It also involves the interactions which occur between each population. Ecosystems include non-living things like soil, air and water. They act as a supply of materials to help organisms survive and reproduce. Organisms may be competing with each other in an ecosystem, for example, plants could be competing for light and space, animals may be competing with each other for food and mates. So we've made it to the end of the video. If you found this video useful and you've made it to the end, leave a 100 emoji. And if you have any questions about this topic, leave a comment and I'll do my best to get back to you. Thank you.